this morning i was about to book the session the moment i noticed your availability then i thought of again you know booking my session with you again because i started my journey with you only so i really it was my heart was feeling that i must take hello mr vishal hello ma'am how are you i am good how are you so we meet after almost one or two months yeah so you remember so, me yes yes you are on youtube ma'am <laughs> because of you, you you i am on youtube too <laughs> uh i started uh, my journey with uh, that particular video i i i think i told you at that time also right, right. Uh, and that was my first session uh, which i attended while parking my car on the i highway. i remember i remember, I remember. <laughs> nice <laughs> yeah so how is the journey been the youtube journey it's been wonderful good do you think it, it is it is day by day i'm getting uh, something day by day is it has it been converted into monetary and all or is it just uh, you for... you're talking about my journey on youtube yeah on youtube and See, obviously me, clapping also actually actually for the time being it's all mainly related to clapping sessions but of right. course i have so much so much in my on my card uh which i have not started with right now but of course in future uh, i'm coming up on youtube with all that stuff so it's just a beginning so i'm i don't think of like um, monitoring and other things right it's just the beginning of the journey yeah, so, yeah. i'm yeah. not delivering uh, uh, i know i'm not delivering uh, good or quality stuff there it's all about just uh, for the time being the running of the clipping go sessions only yeah yeah i'm making all the preparations actually for the time being okay yeah nice So, ma'am, you taken fifteen, sixteen sessions till now. Uh, so many. Seventy. So yeah. So all all with different tutors. Yeah, this is for the first time that uh, when uh, um, uh, this morning I was about to book the session, the moment I noticed your availability, then I thought of again, uh, you know, booking my session with you again because I started my journey with you only. so i really it was my uh, heart uh, or feeling that i must take this session with you only today right yeah but us- usually we have this thing of clapping that the tutors we tutors are you know reason that you that demand supply ratio is some sometimes yeah they are not like available man yeah. yeah number of times i sometimes i try to book my session with the the same tutor but most of the time most of the time they are not available yeah but in in my case what i do is like give the session in the morning itself so every day i decide that well, if i am going to give slots or not and if i am going to give at what time so i don't do it for a week in advance there are tutors who do it almost a week in advance and they have the month planned out mm, right. right so that that's even, not even when i was about to book the slot i noticed mm-hmm. uh, your three slots uh, which suited me as by my, my schedule when right. i tried to book the first one immediately i got the information just now it has been booked by somebody then i try for the second one then again i got the same notification it has oh. been booked <laughs> then i click the third one and by chance i got that <laughs> okay that third this r itself right yeah so this this r i had one uh, 20, the 25 minute session because of which i think two slots uh, are basically taken up So this okay. is a 15 minute session no this is yeah, also this is just a 15 minute session 15 minute session so in that case all two slots i think they, they would have shown as book now okay. one was only okay. available in that case okay. okay so ma'am have you gone through the session notes uh yeah you will see okay. i have just gone through i yeah okay so it says helping a friend move yeah right hmm. so a friend what of yours is so what would i do <laughs> now you are going yeah. to ask me what would i do yes okay. so uh, mr vishal my first uh, question to my friend would be i would rather i would like to know about the exact place where my friend is moving suppose if she is getting transferred so it is very important for me that in my city where is the location of uh, his or her office where she is moving right then second thing will be definitely i would like i would like to acquaint him or her with the 
location of the railway station and the bus stand so that he or she right. may have idea that how far it is from those locations to to reach how much it is going to take to reach to her or his destination right. so this will be my first move initially right. so that's the food afterwards then comes food how would you suggest them to where would you take them to you know on the weekend or suggest them him or her to eat so on the regular depends, days also uh, i would definitely like to know if she is moving alone or moving along with the family because if she is moving right. alone then the requirement should be different if Correct. it's with the uh, move is with the family then of course so many other things you get associated with also and right. uh, whatever be the condition if suppose with the even with the family if she she is moving with the family and on the weekend everybody tries to uh, move out for dining so i will definitely let her know the main places the main eatery junctions which are available right. knowing after knowing that if she loves to have vegetarian food or she loves to have the non vegetarian mm-hmm. or the traditional food or the continental So accordingly, my city, every city is, I think, full of uh, so many such places, and yeah. every city has nook and corner where the street food is also available. So it depends upon his or her requirements. So I will act accordingly. I will guide her according to that. Okay. Which areas would you suggest uh, him or her to live in, and why so? Again, uh, the main thing is it depends where is her working place. Otherwise, where I am living, it is near to Darshnagar. I live in Jalandhar, and this is a very good locality because it's on one hand it is in the heart of the city, and at the other hand it's easily approachable. I mean, you can drive your car through. Like uh, if you talk about the core of the city, then sometimes it's very difficult to move there because it's so much. There is so much of the crowd inside. Mm-hmm. Then if uh, you are to go for some more polished. and more open area than model town in every city is i think that is known as you know uh, main central place to live so it depends upon the her pocket also how much she can yeah, spend true. that is very important correct so accordingly i will suggest her or him to live in this or that particular area correct and yeah which places would you suggest them to take away take for a weekend get weekend get away For outings, you mean? Yeah, for outings, we can do it. Chilandar, there are two uh, very good places in Chilandar, mm-hmm. and one is just a bit on the outskirts, touching to Chilandar. That is a science city. It's a place worth seeing because uh, mm-hmm. cities have become very crowded. There is no such place which is having a bigger area to hang right. out, enjoy. Right. They are mostly out of the on the outskirts. They are situated on the outskirts of the city. So. Mm-hmm. one place i would suggest her that is a science city it's, it's a science museum and a place okay. worth seeing and because why would i suggest her this place because it's a uh, equally important uh, for children as well as for uh, it has all sure. options for the adults also right um if you want to explore science like ranging from life sciences to the space to the celestial bodies you would find everything there There are so Correct. many uh, exhibit science exhibits are there. Then mm-hmm. uh, static galleries are there. Then science museums are there. Then uh, indoor uh, stadiums are also there, and the theaters. That is the main attraction. So there is so much to see. And uh, if you are suppose uh, growing tired there, then there are the um, on-site uh, eatable junctions available where you can have. Uh, food from snacks to the full meal everything is available there right and you can experience science in a very informative and um, interesting way so this is one place another mm-hmm. is if you want to go to some amusement park for the rides or water park you enjoy you, you want to have that kind of uh, day then right. there is wonders land that is on the other side of the city again on the outskirts just 5 or 6 out uh, kilometers outside jalanda right. Right. That is also a wonderful place. Got it. Okay. And if she is a female, right? Obviously, where would you take them for shopping? <laughs> <laughs>
um actually now cities have become very crowded otherwise everything is available inside the city but we have stopped going to the inside of the cities because it's very difficult to park your vehicle yeah true, now true. on the on main roads of the city and again to the model town area all big brands are there so uh, majority of the people who are in service they prefer to they go for online shopping this is always their first priority but even if he or she intends to go in person and um, select the things at her uh, his or her own then i would mm-hmm. take her to the model town area okay so ma'am uh, i think last time we had a conversation you told me that you're working professionally yourself right yeah correct so apart from that if you have free time to yourself what hobbies do you pursue uh i am a nature lover ardent nature lover i used okay. to spend time with my plants so i have uh, built up a beautiful small lawn in my house and i want to have the plants in their wild shape like i don't like the scissors so okay. even, i don't like uh, cutting them so wherever whenever i am on the road i am moving somewhere i always keep the gadgets along with me in my car and wherever i see suppose every day i am passing through some area and i am noticing that this is a beautiful plant but it is a sort of waste here then if possible then i would like to uproot that plant and bring it home and plant it somewhere oh. in the lawn or in the post pot that way that's nice though. yeah i spend okay. time that way so yeah on the streets basically that it happens that even if they are planted but you know at least in where i stay there are a lot of panchi pichkari and all that right because of which you know spitting and all they get ruined very badly mm-hmm. right that yeah. all the uh, small toes insect insects and all are uh, insecticide sides are basically spoiling them yeah. correct so do, do you read on a regular basis ma'am reading books you reading? mean yeah yes no this is the only habit which i couldn't develop sorry straight forward i am everybody around me has tried a lot everybody around me like my kids my daughter she is very she is an avid uh, reader she mm. reads lots of books and i have a very good collection of the books but this is the only habit which i couldn't develop, develop. yeah mm. i couldn't develop okay like so ma'am uh, i'll just come to the feedback part of your session ji obviously right. we as we know that you have a very good command over the language there are just a little bit of pronunciation errors yeah right <clears throat> or grammatical errors also we can say so in one of the sentences you told me that uh, if a person is growing tired so they yeah. can uh, sit there or relax or have food right so i think the best word to use is getting tired yeah getting tired yeah right. so we will use grow for basically you know referring the age right so growth of a plant growth of a person right, right. is basically age or time yeah and i think you mispronounced the word prefer prefer as prefer i said prefer yeah prefer i know it's prefer prefer perfect you know it <laughs> correct so yeah, otherwise uh, it's quite fine enough but if you can you okay. know keep on reading something or even listening to podcast and all it will just help you in the longer run Yeah, I I have developed that habit of listening to podcasts. Recently, I have started that. I listen to motivational speakers, and okay. it it solves me my two purposes. <clears throat> Is it motivates you in the morning when I'm heading towards my office? It gives right. you lots of motivation, energizes you. Then, second thing, I keep, always try to keep a check on the words used, vocabulary used, and the pro- and and the preposition along with it because correct. Uh, the kind of background i have come from uh, although uh, i assume i am familiar with the vocabulary but i used to make the mistake when preposition is used and you know if a wrong right. preposition is used the meaning becomes altogether different yes so yeah i i have i do that in the morning yeah correct so yeah i hope ma'am it was an informative session for you it was really right. nice talking to you for the second time i don't know whether yeah. in the future i would get this kind of opportunity or not but hope today, so i think as first i had the opportunity and i didn't want to miss it surely ma'am <laughs> same feeling sir okay so ma'am we'll meet in the future so that's possible and thank yeah you. best of luck for your journey the clapping go and you to both journeys thank you thank you so much nice yeah bye 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 bye